La la lucky latte. Wait, that goes so hard. It's like nothing I've ever experienced before. What is before. it? And do we tell them who we saw in there? There was a celeb in there. I forgot that this had arrived. I wasn't here when it showed up. The stadium is gorgeous. It's like stunning. This weekend, we're flying to Seattle. We're going to our anatomy scan. I can't wait to see our babies. This is like the big scan. Oh yeah, I don't want to have a baby update like this, but we can. <laughs> this was the best moment of my life. Today's video is sponsored by Timu, and to celebrate their one year anniversary, they have thousands of $1 items on their app for the entire month of September. And before you go anywhere, I have the most insane Timu haul for you right now. Okay, so I'm just unboxing all of my stuff, but Shane already came in, of course, and he's trying to steal my tumbler. They have these 40 ounce tumblers that are only a dollar and 34 cents. This is for me. Thank you, Timu, I love my new tumbler. I ordered these mini box cutters, and it's been so useful, they're so cute, so small, but you can honestly just like snip anything open. Bitch, these are so trendy right now with my Timu knife cutter. Cut it right open. Oh my gosh, you're kidding me. Oh. They're like walking on clouds, baby. When I tell you I was shook about this mirror, this looks like all the skim stuff that you got me. Are you kidding me? And it props up on its own so I can just look at myself. Hello, gorgeous. I like tried to make a complete look. Silly goose. Oh, that's cute. Oh. And then if I want to become a silly goose, look at my rose wine glass. Get ready for your summer favorite, Shane. This thing is powerful. Like, I bet your hair would blow in the wind with this. Ooh, yeah, I like that. <laughs> it's me proof, because you can't put your finger in it and get it chopped off. Cute little, like, cat base. <laughs> I'm gonna cute. test this out in the car. It is super clean slime. So you take it out, get all the crevices in your car, like all this stuff that you can never get. It works. Bitch, when I tell you I've always wanted one of these. It's an iPhone microphone that you can just like put into your iPhone then clip. So I can be all the way behind my bushes and be like, good morning girls. Wow, I'm actually living for my Timu mic. Are you ready to be shook? Yeah. Positivity potato. I may be a tiny potato, but I believe in you. And then an optimistic sunflower. You can attach it to things, like you can attach it to your cup. <laughs> Oh. An AirPods donut holder, and then like a hair removal. We have velvet couches down in our dining room and they attract so much cat hair. So we're gonna test these out. This is probably more for you than me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. I saw that. That is funny. So download the Timu app using the link in my description section below to get your $100 off coupon bundle or search Ryland100 on the app to claim. This special one year anniversary sale is only one month long and it will end at the end of September. So make sure to shop now so you can get thousands of items for only $1. And the very best part of all of this is Timu is offering new users the Nintendo Switch OLED for only $259, which is insane. It's over $100 more than that originally. And that's after you apply your $100 coupon bundle with code Rylan100. Again, use the link in my description section below to download their fantastic app. Timu, thank you so much for sponsoring today's video and I hope you all enjoy. Good morning and welcome to day two of, this is probably a different vlog at this point. I think it's day three, brother. <laughs> this has been wild for my emotional stability. No, 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 I have to talk to you about some things. Oh, no. First of all, Elizabeth is a psychopath. <laughs> she was shaming me for not having a fucking bed sheet. You know, the sheet between hugs It's a the top mattress. sheet, you fucking psycho. What's the thing that hugs the mattress? A fitted sheet. Okay, so I have a fitted sheet, I have a duvet, and I have a duvet cover. Anything else is too hot and too much work. It's archaic and it's something that you've carried on to torture yourself, to torture me as a housewife. You want me to not only put all the other things on, but then put another fucking sheet that's just gonna get kicked to the bottom of the bed anyways, you psychopath. You're a literal heathen. And she started a group chat dragging me. I can't believe it. I can't. So here's my other problem I have with you. <laughs> this is toxic. <laughs> She fucking just leaves TV on wherever she goes. And last night we're like watching The Incredibles and I like get up to wash my face and I have to pause it. And she's like, no. And I'm like, yes, because then I'm gonna miss the plot line. And she's of like, The Incredibles? You're obsessed with Gilmore Girls, but you just walk away while it's playing. And it's like, 
How are you gonna miss 25 minutes and just I'm, keep going? Cause it's I'm, like I'm saving you, some of it for myself for later. But then you have to figure out where you left no, off. No, 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 I just keep going. So the 25 minutes you've missed. I've missed full episodes. Fine. You're crazy. I don't watch something but if I don't come, wanna watch I something. But I'm gonna come, I wanna enjoy it so again another time so it'll be like a new experience. You're crazy. Yes, She just know. leaves. Here's something else though. You have a big audience. What do you mean? This is unrelated to you. This is for me. <laughs> if you watch Gilmore Girls, can you please sound off in the comments below if it's like a thing that they're constantly referencing Patty Hearst. We're not having a Gilmore's girl Please conversation on the vlog. I need to know what they think. <laughs> okay, we're going to breakfast. We're going to start our day. Goodbye. I need to know. I forgot that this had arrived. I wasn't here when it showed up. Oh, it's nice, dude. I literally was like, I'm going to take all my pills so I'm healthy for Taylor Swift day. <laughs> Shoving down pills and immediately I'm nauseous because I have not eaten anything. Isn't that so comfortable? Yeah. Is it good one? No. Of course you can try it, you goose. You need something for your feebies. I opted out of that. Oh, what? Why? Yeah, I'm gonna go like this. Why would I go like this? I don't know. That does not feel comfortable to me. Woo, the nausea is kicking in, girl. We gotta go get breakfast. I'm morning Are sick you gonna throw fuck. up? Do you like my bassinets? Yeah, I do. That'll be mine. <laughs> okay, girls. Come on out of here. We got two snooze for the twins. They're little smart bassinets. Oh my gosh. Girl, you're walking slow. You're walking so slow, girl. I had to put it back down. There are quite the list of instructions on the outside, but. Oh shit. With its own little swaddles, which is one of the things I was excited about for this, is it keeps the baby on their back. That's one less thing to worry about. And then if they wake up, woo, it will start rocking, introduce some sound, start to, you know, try to soothe the baby if they don't actually need to get up. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So cute! It's a sleeping baby. Oh my gosh, I turned it on and look at it, it does a little rock with the white noise. Well, yeah, I can only really use this for six months, so. Should we wait until you vomit and then leave? At this point, I don't know. Look how cute those clothes are. Not the manatee. Who oh, I'm sick. Do you want to wait to throw up or do you just want to go? What's the I deal? I literally popped like, I popped dandelion, I popped zinc, I popped like vitamin. Did you start taking dandelion because I said you should start taking dandelion? Yes. <gasps> Of course I did. I love that. Wow, I'm gonna be sick. You should throw up probably, right? I don't know. Wow, why did I do that? I'm so excited for Taylor Swift. I was like, nothing can go wrong. And I just put so many pills in my mouth. Uh, this is problematic. Oh, oh go to the bathroom. You're you gonna throw up. Oh my God. <laughs> this is so unhinged. <laughs> so we're waiting till you throw up. Can you feel it? It's super soft. So cute. <laughs> Matt. <laughs> Look at the oh, astrology. That's so soft. They're so soft. What size is that? Three? I don't know. I'm starting to get clothes a little further out because a lot of the moms that I've been watching, they're like, the newborn goes so quick yeah. and you don't know and then it's like better to have an arsenal of things yeah. that are a little further out. Well, that passed. It did? Do you think it's going to come back? Oh, we just can't do this with you. We gotta go. <laughs> Maybe it was the gliding that made me sick. Get out of the glider. Are we waiting for you to throw up or are we gonna This is this? so cute. I'm gonna go back to Gilmore Look Girls. Look at it from the side. Stupid. Okay, I pretty genuinely think the moment has passed. Elizabeth. Which car are we taking? Mine. Oh, I didn't have to move my car. This Wait, one? where were you parked? On that side. Are you kidding me? No, this is so you. Okay, grab the camera and let's go. Oh, you were you filming? Me? Ah! <laughs> gotcha, bitch! God, gotcha again! Gotcha you. again! Can we go to Blue Jam? What's that? It's a breakfast place. I mean, do they have real food? Yeah, like hearty food to set us up for success for the rest of the day. Okay, yes. Then we're gonna stop by the commons. I'm gonna try to get a little outfit for tonight. I have a floofy black cowboy hat for you if you want it that has a tiara on it. Oh, you mean the one you've already worn and yes. have already been seen at the Eras Tour wearing? Well, to be fair, I'm not sure anyone saw me. I wasn't <laughs> seeable. Did you even really pose like stories? No. You didn't? In the moment. No, but you took videos, so the next day you had them. Yeah, I've just been looking at them and crying by myself. And that's the thing about an illicit affair. All right, we'll see you at breakfast. So we're at Blue Jam Cafe and I was just telling Lizzie, actually the last time I was here, it was meeting with the Spotify lawyer to go over like the details of the contract of our podcast that then got canceled. It was good negotiation on my part yeah. up until that happened, until it got canceled. You know what I mean? We're still having fun. 
I'm on vocal rest. Oh, same. We really didn't need to scream the whole way home. Wow, this dressing room, wild. I'm like, actually feel like I'm on drugs me. A little sit down. Uh -huh. <laughs> Have you never seen the turtles? No, this is so You've cute. You've never oh seen the God. turtles? There's hundreds of thousands. Do you want to get me looking like a crusty, dusty turd? Okay, so we went to La La Land, which is like a new cafe in the Calabasas Commons. La La Latte? No, La La Land. But this is, what did they call this? La La Lucky Latte. La La Lucky Latte. And it's their ice latte with, actually, I thought it was gonna be like a gag, but it actually looks pretty good. Can I eat one of the marshmallows? Yeah, pull it off. Wait, that goes so hard. I mean, of course it's good. It's a Lucky Charms in foamed milk. Also, look how delicious their drinks look. Bro, you need to just eat a marshmallow. Okay, I'll start with a marshmallow. They're really oh, good. Fuck. Isn't that incredible? Wow, 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 wow. What's the foam? They called it a cloud. What is it? It's like nothing I've ever experienced What is before. it? Can I lick it? Yeah, it's like nothing I've had before. No, it's whipped cream. It's really thick. Yeah, it's whipped cream. I think it's a authentically whipped cream though. I don't, I don't think it's like canned whipped cream. I think they whipped cream. I thought this was like a gag drink just to like shock no. people that were coming in. This it's, is who we are now. The coffee element is delicious. Oh my God, I could bust. I want to fuck it so bad. Watch yourself. You might get pregnant. Should we both fuck this it? This is too close. <laughs> you might get pregnant. You can get pregnant from a la 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 Here, three try times. part. Bitch. I would eat this like an ice cream. This was the best decision we've made so far. I'm so glad that you suggested we do something like that. I was thinking, what would Shane do? Like Shane would opt to get the fun thing, to try the fun thing, to have some fun. This is like, what even is this trash? Well, it's because you decided to get matcha. Whoa. Everything pales in comparison to the Lucky Charms. This place is cute. How much was this for three drinks? I think I spent 20 bucks. That is so good. And it's a Calabasas exclusive. It's only here. And do we tell them who we saw in there? We saw Gracie Gomez in there. Last night we were watching like, stories from Taylor, the concert, and she was like, oh my gosh, Selena and her sister are there. And then we walk into this coffee shop and there's a girl in there wearing a ta like Taylor Swift merch. And Lizzie texts me and she's like, that's Selena Gomez's sister, be cool. Don't say anything, just be chill. And I Shut was like- Shut the fuck up, that I get a little excited when I see a tiny Swifty in the wild. Okay, I'll talk to you guys later. T-T-Y-L. E-T. We made it to Crossroads. Thank God. Your hair looks so cute. I promise. Mm -hmm. Okay. I got a drink. We got a Caesar salad. Okay. <laughs> drink taste test time. Wow, I love it. The stadium is gorgeous. I guess because it's brand new. It's like stunning. Los Angeles, California. Welcome to the Eras Tour. We're just gonna walk up this for three more miles. It's over. We have to pretend like we have personalities outside of this now. It's really scary for some of us who aren't ready to do that kind of self-discovery. This is too much to vlog right here. Bye. See ya. Should I leave? I don't think so. <laughs> this is sad that you still have your jewels in your hair. <laughs> this is fun. Ow.
See you soon. Bye. Okay, Elizabeth and I slept for three and a half hours. I got on a 9 a.m. flight and I'm already back in Colorado. We did it. The most fun, successful summer vacation ever. Hello, good morning, girlies. Um, it's a very exciting weekend for a lot of reasons. I'm trying to find something to put you on. Good morning. What's happening? <gasps> First of all, this weekend we're flying to Seattle. We're going to our anatomy scan, our 20 week ultrasound. I'm so excited. I just pulled in the house. We got our coffee and a much awaited package has come for us. What? I've been trying to get my hands on like something cute from Dutch Brothers. Dutch Bros. I know all of you guys always say Dutch Bros. And I saw this while I was standing in line at Disneyland and I thought we have to have it. What? We have to have it. Well, I guess you could open it. What is it? I mean, it's just silly, but it's so fun. It's a Disneyland? Oh yeah, Shane was all mad I didn't get him a Disneyland gift. Wait, this is from Disneyland? No, look at the box. Well, you said you found it at Disneyland. <laughs> no, I did, I was in line, and it was an advertisement on Instagram. It's just stupid, but it's so cute and fun. What is it? I mean, I'm definitely overhyping this. It's literally not even that exciting. I just like. I'm scared. <laughs> this is just silly. <gasps> They're plushy slippers these? that are Dutch Bros. Ah! Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's only these one are size. So, so cute. They're just like, because we're into plushies lately and we Stop. love no. Dutch Brothers. The advertisement that I bought them on was like this girl in her bed just like kicking her feet back and I just had to do it. Look at them. Oh wait, they are cuter than I thought. They're so cute. <gasps> Riley's gonna eat them. They're so cute. Okay, we have a lot to do, girlies. Are you excited to go back to Seattle with us? Are you excited to go to Seattle, Shane? Yeah. I can't wait to see our babies. This is like the big scam. Scam? Scam. Oh. It's, I think, an hour for each baby. I think it's like a two hour uh, doctor's appointment. And I just can't wait to see how Max and Jet have grown. Our surrogate has uh, messaged us and told us they're kicking now. Oh my gosh, I just am so freaking excited. I am also very excited about this because it's the alarm clock that wakes you up as like the sun is coming up. And I don't have, like I rely on my my phone to be my alarm. And so it's gonna be really nice to like know what time it is without touching my phone and seeing notifications or texts because I have so many friends. <laughs> so I am very excited to open this and use it. Oh my gosh. I guess I do text you a lot after you go to bed. Yeah, Shane texts me what's going on with the Big Brother live feeds a million times. And I wake up to everything, a play-by-play -play of what had happened the night before. Wow. Damn, she's gorgeous. I actually got this for the bedroom in California because it matches that color palette really beautifully. Right, right. We're testing out our alarm. And Riley's like, what's going on? What's going on? Also, love these. I didn't see the side when they were first being unboxed. So I'm lit, sisters. Hi, Ryan. I already kissed my cats goodbye. Bye, Cheeto. I love you. All right, and we're off. Let's go! Perfect for our big brother viewing. And look at it. Oh my gosh. 
wow. Oh my gosh. Fun. Has a really cute ocean view. I can't wait to go out there, walk around and like see everything that's going on. <gasps> cute. Are these little chocolate sticks? Mm. I love those. Morning, princess. <laughs> Stupid. Ooh, good morning, girls. Today's the day. I'm so excited to see our boys. Hello, girlies. Good morning. Oh, it zoomed all the way in. Maybe that was my problem. <gasps> we had a great time in Seattle. We were just rushing around and running around everywhere and having so much fun that we didn't really vlog much. So I guess we'll give an update when we get back to the house. We're getting ready at the hotel to go back to Colorado right now, but the babies look so good. And now I feel like Shane's listening to me. It's like vlogging when somebody else is in the house, but they're not vlogging with you. It's weird. <laughs> oh my God, Shane, stop. <laughs> I knew, I was like, <laughs> you look insane. <laughs> well, can you sit down for one second? I'm in the middle of my routine. <laughs> oh yeah, I don't want to have a baby update like this. <laughs> but we can't. <laughs> I mean, are you kidding me? The thumbnail is this, with you doing this. I was just saying like, we found. Okay, I don't do this at home, by the way. <laughs> because we have the. <laughs> Yeah, this, that's, this is a new... We had the best time here. We found the cutest hotel. We found a casino and Shane won huge. Found a casino. Like we put a 20. $100, bitch. And I said, okay, I put in a 20. I won 500 and I was walking around and I was crying. I was so excited. I was like, started with a 20, now I'm here. <laughs> Started with the Tina. Okay, and then we found a dog. There's a lot going on. We'll talk about it later. Oh uh, yeah. Oh fine. Yeah, I can see your butt. <laughs> you better blur it. <laughs> fine. We'll recap our trip later. We're headed to the airport now. And we're back home. Honestly, that trip was so fast moving and such a whirlwind that we didn't like film the process. There were some things like in that hospital compared to where we went the first time, there were signs everywhere that was like, no filming, no photographs, no phones. And although it's kind of like a bummer that we don't have it documented like the first one, we were so present. And I really did enjoy that they're like memories that are cemented in my brain forever. I don't remember. I don't remember what, what is this video? <laughs> what is Are this? you kidding me? This is us just getting back from Seattle. We got back a long time ago. We got back a few days ago. Two days I'm ago. Well, oh, okay, so this is like, we're doing an update. What There's a you, whole vlog. What, what are you talking about? There is? I don't remember you filming there. Now I remember. I thought we were gonna do this update in Seattle, but you shamed me for my towel. Oh. Yeah, I was not about to do that with the towel on, but we met our surrogate at uh, the hospital that our babies will be delivered at. We walked in. Of course, we didn't film because I don't know, like the privacy of the surrogate. And they also had like no cell phone signs, like I said. So we were just fully there and present, but it was the big 20 week anatomy scan and it was magical. It was crazy. I know I keep saying this, but this was the best moment of my life. I've said that through every step of the process, but this specifically was the best moment of my life. And let me explain. So it was like two hours, one hour per baby. They were doing the ultrasound, they, the whole like on the stomach. Yeah. <laughs> and which I want to get for myself. Can you imagine? What do you mean? Seeing what's in there? I don't know, it just seemed fun. <laughs> they had an air playing to the TV. I was like, this is a whole night. Just like us doing that to each other. Anyways, yeah, so they, they, and then they put it on her stomach and boom, right away. It was like a movie. There was two babies floating around and one of them, we don't know who, like genetic is whose, we don't really care about that. <laughs> but I kind of think baby A, might be my genetics because it would not shut up. It was like, you could see its mouth moving. It was like, blah, 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 blah. And then baby B, when she went over to baby B, it was going like this, like, shut up, which was 
the crazy it was so real because it is real it was a lot but you could see the fully formed humans growing inside the surrogate it was so crazy and to see them kicking moving stretching flipping opening their mouths and even yawning like their heart beating it was just so crazy so okay the important things so far everything looks great everything looks healthy the doctor was very excited we were very excited they gave us like eight pictures that they printed out of the um of the ultrasounds not the best pictures <laughs> like literally you can't see anything but like while we were there watching we didn't film any of it because we weren't allowed to but while we were there watching it was insane like a movie and then the pictures they printed were not great and i thought because she was getting such great views of the kids i thought all of those were going to be pictures yeah. and we get the pictures back and it's just like really close up but the one picture that i'm so happy she got i can't believe she got it so what a queen so ultrasound woman thank you there is a moment where one of the babies gave a thumbs up and it was so crazy it was so real like the baby literally was like yeah and we were just like, thumbs up, oh my god, it's a sign, everything's gonna be great. And then when she gave us the pictures, one of those was there, and then I got it free. <laughs> oh my gosh. So now we can look at this all the time and be like, hey, everything's gonna go good. <laughs> so it was amazing. That was, and honestly, it was kind of cool that we couldn't film any of it. Not that we were going to, but it wasn't even an option. And I kind of like that because now it's just in our memories. Like, cause I'll never forget that. No. We have better uh, full body pictures from the 12 week scan, but everything happens for a reason. There's like an actual windstorm happening. <laughs> so. Oh God, that was really scary. Okay, we cannot get sucked up into a tornado right now. Things are going too good. <laughs> but it was so fun. We rescued a dog. We reunited it with its owner. That's a whole in-depth, lengthy story. But Shane and I did start an audio-only podcast and we told the entire story there. So I'll have that uh, linked in the description section below. It's called Fights with Shane and Ryland. And I think it's gonna be every week. For Depending now. on how much we fight. We literally saved a life and I saw a drug deal. So if you want the whole experience, listen to the podcast. <laughs> it's on my Shane Dawson podcast feed, like on Spotify and <laughs> iTunes and everything. Just look for like the lowercase titles. But the trip was so much fun. We packed so much into a day and a half. Yeah. We went to a baby store. Yeah, this is for one of the babies. And, got, both. and I got two little onesies in Seattle. And I just, I just can't wait. It's starting to feel so real. It's like right around the corner now. We're like buying all the products doing all the things, having so much fun, counting how many Four months. Four months. Yeah. Four months, are you kidding me? <gasps> it should be uh, mid-December, full-term pregnancy with twins is 38 weeks. So that will be like December 15th to like 20 something for us. <sighs> we need to, you know, prepare to have two children. Mm -hmm. But you know, besides that, everything's easy. <laughs> It's all, it's all gonna be good. Well, we'll see you with another update hopefully soon. And oh my gosh, it's happening. Yay! Bye.